No, it's been good. I think so far it's been a good trip. We had a good Q and A last night with uh, with Carl and myself, and I think uh, the people really enjoyed that. And then today we had a good um, yeah presentation at the Wireless Secondary College, and then as you can see now we're doing a good uh, little coaching clinic. So it's good to be back. Good to see some familiar faces, and uh, yeah, really enjoyed enjoyed my time being back. Yeah, I lived here until I was uh, until I was 18, so um, I've got a lot of memories here. Um, just seeing all the streets, all the buildings that I used to hang out at, um, the beach, um, all the football pitches that I played at when I was younger, going back and visiting all them and um, yeah, just reminiscing over the good times. It brings back a lot of good memories and um, yeah, I really enjoyed my time in Wyla and I always enjoy coming back. Yeah, I was saying that to my mum and dad last night, like it was something that I sort of yeah, dreamed of as a kid. You know, I wanted that Adelaide United shirt, I wanted to wear the number 13 and, um, and represent Adelaide United. And, and I always said to myself, if I ever did get to Adelaide United, it's something that I wanted to do was to come back to Wyler and do something similar to what we're doing now, holding coaching clinics and just showing the younger generation that, um, you know, even though like we are at sort of a disadvantage being in the country in terms of facilities and coaches, it, it, it can still be done. So, um, no, nah, it's a bit of a surreal moment. Um, like I'm still pinching myself now being back in Wyler as, a, as an Adelaide United player. Yeah, no, they're always always happy to for me to come back, and um, even though they come up to Adelaide quite quite regularly, it's sort of um, once you come back home, it's sort of a different. Um, yeah, they love it, so um, it's good for them. Yeah, I remember um, when I was probably I think nine years old. I think we had um, a Croatian under twenty one team come out and a Liverpool under under twenty one team as well. So I don't know how that transpired or how that even come about, but I remember doing a little coaching clinic with the Liverpool under twenty players at the time. And then a few years later, um, back in the early days of Adelaide United, maybe when I was 12 or 13, uh, Adelaide United played a friendly game in Port Pirie, which a lot of people from Wyla travelled up uh, to, to go see. And, um, you know, legends like, you know, Travis Dodd and, and Cole Veer were, were, were big names back then. And, um, yeah, so it was... Uh, yeah, I don't think they ever came to Wyler as such, but you know, going to Port Berry was a huge thing for us. Yeah, it's huge. I mean, I remember when I was young and getting taught by you know th those players is just you know you look up to them like they're you know they're, they're your idols. You know, when you're young, you don't know any different, and you just want to be be like them. So for them to come out, you know, I know now how busy it is. I've been a footballer, but for them to come out of their um, out of their schedules, come down and say hello, you know, teach a few things, it was huge. It had a massive influence on my career and um, something that I inspired to be.